Hey guys, Kyle here, or I guess it's now, I guess my official name, official handle is Death Knight of Anime. Thank, thanks, and, and all thanks to, uh, a big, and a big shout out to Anime with Attitude for, for, for the fantastic, the fantastic new, 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 new YouTube banner, but, uh, yeah, I guess that, that's gonna take some getting used to, but, uh, <coughs> yeah, right now I'm <coughs> Death Knight of Anime, and I'm coming at you guys with, with the latest the latest uh, manga chapter for One Piece, manga the manga chapter eight hundred and fifty four, <clears throat> and to be honest with you, the one thing I feel that this that this chapter just kind of reinforced entirely is that it reinforced how much of a psychotic bitch Big Mom is. Like it's been it's been shown time and time and time and time again that Big Mom is just. It is it is completely psychotic, but this just this just again showed the depths of her depravity. So we basically start off with with Jinbei, Nami, and Lu Jinbei and, and Nami run, run, running. Jimmy, Nami, and Pedro run, run, running through the run, 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 running running away from from a couple of Big Mom's thugs, and then and then shortly after meeting up with Pedro. It, it, uh, it's basically revealed that Jinbei didn't even apparently di didn't didn't even uh, di 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 didn't even di di didn't even do 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 the whole roulette thing because apparently according to Pedro that that thing is basically just one giant trap n n apparently no no apparently and apparent and Jinbei apparently saw through it apparently no 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 matter what what kind what well, no matter what, 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 what you spin or what, whatever you land on, apparently you, you are going to die in either way. And like I said, that just kind of further shows like the depths of Big Mom's depravity. Like fucking really, you, you you're gonna you're gonna kill them in either way. Like I guess that just just shows you how much like ser like I guess it just shows how her her character like she, she's willing to she's willing to give them a little bit of hope. But then dash that shit away, like, really, Big Mom, really, like, holy fucking shit, like that was that's insane. Uh, but after that, we, we we also we also switch we also switch again over to Big Mom and Pudding, where where it shows that Brooke has been has been basically captured captured by Big Mom and that the, 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 yeah the, the, that that guy right now, he is in deep shit, but. <clears throat> But it's interesting because what's interesting about that particular scene is that uh, it's it's a, but is that they're talking basically right in front of him, is that they're all talking right right in front of Brooks. So basically leak leaking all all their plans to Brooks. So right leaking all their plans like right in front of Brooks. So like it's like they 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 have no they have, just because just because he he has. Just because they have Brook captured, that they have no concern of, of what he hears. So th that that could be Oda possibly possibly giving us giving us some kind of insight that po possibly Brook Brook is going to escape, and he's going to and he's going to pull that Brook is going to pull some shady, shady shit. Like he's gonna he's gonna he's really gonna pull some stuff. He's really gonna escape in some manner. I'm not sure how. And then he's gonna and and then he's gonna help help out the others. I assume or I don't know. Maybe even help out. How about Vin Smokes? Who knows? Uh, but yeah, the, but the, the big thing about that particular scene, though, aside from Brooke being kidnapped and hearing the whole conversation, is the conversation itself, which again just kind of goes into into the state of Big Mom's depravity. Like, sh sh uh, but at this, sh right now, how how they have it planned out is when Sanji lifts up the veil, big. Pudding's basically going to shoot, shoot, shoot him, shoot him in the, shoot him in the head, and then from there, in all the confusion of it, she's basically going to have the entire. She's gonna, she's gonna basically have a, a basically an, an execution squad, and basically an execution squad completely, completely, uh, completely execute the the rest of the, completely execute the, the rest of the Vin Smokes. Now, of course, as we. Now there is one major. Now of course, as there is one major problem with this plan, of course. But I'll 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 get into that later. But 
Yeah, like, again, how fucking depraved is Big Mom at, at this, like, seriously, this, again, I, I know I'm, I know I'm basically, uh, I know I'm basically just kind of, uh, I know I'm basically just kind of reiterating the same thing over and over, but yeah, just, just this whole plan in its entirety, it, it really just shows the, the level of her depravity, it's like, wow, Big Mom, you... You, you're you're into some you're into some heavy shit. I'm I'm not gonna lie. Um, and after that, we 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 also get a uh, we also get a uh, we also get a we also it also the 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 scene changes to uh, the scene changes to um, the scene cha the scene changes to uh, a, a a a group of Big Mom's upper echelon who we're talking about. Who are talking about um, who are, who are basically discussing like all the all the straw hats that, that that have been either eliminated or at the very least incapacitated, and I have a feeling that on on that end, I have a feeling that 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 that, 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 that we we also see that of course uh, we we also see that I think it was relay or uh, I've relay um who's it oh uh. Uh, oh, Opera. Yes, so, sorry, it was Opera. Who is? We apparently found out that, that Opera was apparently that was apparently l l li lying about lying about him killing. Decided to lie to his brothers and sisters and whatnot about killing, about killing Robin and or N N Nami and Luffy because apparently he's too scared of dying that that he wanted to try and save his own hide. So. That 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 lie combined with the fact that, that they think they've. That they believe that they've can, that they've taken out that they've taken out uh, I think it was it was chopper and carrot. I think these elements combined are basically going to compl completely catch completely catch a uh, big big mom's big mom's upper echelon of her crew completely off guard. Like there's a lot of elements with within this chapter for me that felt that uh, the, the the big mom pirates at this time are completely letting down their guard. And that's gonna completely open up for some for some completely, for some completely bombastic straw hat, for some bombastic straw hat stuff to go down like in in the usual fashion as, as we know, as we know Luffy and his Luffy and his crew to do of course. Hell, it's it's already going it's already going down what what, what Nami was doing, but uh, yeah. Uh, and one other thing, the and the final thing to note about this chapter, and again it goes back to what I was saying about. About Big Mom's plan, poss po possibly comp possibly going maybe not not the way she hopes it to, is that uh, is that in the uh, is that in in the final parts of the chapter we we we, we see Sanji there he's he's sulking he's he's kind of he's just kind of he's just kind of completely depressed about what he needs to do, and then. But then, one, ironically enough, one and then funny enough, one final thing, one final thing pushes him forward, which 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 which, which is which is Bobbin, which is Bobbin, uh, coming up to him and and taking like a, taking taking that piece of meat on the bone, and and waving it in front of Sanji's face, which basically, which basically uh, finally pushes Sanji over the edge to basically attack Bobbin. Attack Bobbin and attack Bobbin, knock him out, and and take the and, and take the lunchbox and hurry over to where we could 100% assume to to, to 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 basically in in order to return to his crew, to, to return to his crew or specifically Luffy. So it's 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 of course it's all kind of an interconnecting thing in a way that food and of course because I'm just a cook food is what basically can is basically convinced that the food the lunches he made for 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 pudding is basically what he is is basically what he what he used in order to convince himself to to return to his crew he even said it himself in this chapter I made I made this lunch for pudding no. I didn't. It was all their favorite dishes. So, you you can see that finally Sanji has realized that. Finally, Sanji has realized that this isn't, that this isn't the that he he's he's been basically, 
He's been tr he's in his attempts to try and tr try and forget his crew in order to in order to, in order to save their lives. He's basically been he's basically kept his connection th th through through his cooking. So it's it's just kind of it's it's interesting that that it took it took Bobbin that that one final push in order to con it's just kind of funny that it took Bobbin waving Bobbin one Bobbin taunting him in a way to that one final push in order to give him in order to convince him to basically to basically you know in order to basically go go back to his crew but of course like I said this the the fact that he is on his way back to his crew now this of course also reinforces that their big big mom's plan for big mom's plan with with taking out the bin smokes is going to have that hitch of course because if, if the groom isn't there then what the hell is she going to do I can only assume that when she realizes that the groom doesn't appear, the the only last ditch effort for her would be to completely wipe out the, the entire, <clears throat> just go with the backup plan and just w wipe out the Vin Smoke family from there. But uh, yeah, guys, that's a. Uh, but yeah, guys, that, that that's that, that's that, that's uh, that's my review of Mong the One Piece manga chapter eight hundred and fifty four. Um, and of course, this is me under. And then under the new brand, and the new brand, 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 brand of Death Knight of Anime. I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be using that. I'm probably gonna be using that title a lot more in my videos now. But uh, yeah, my, again, a big shout out to, uh, big shout out to Anime with Attitude. If if there are any uh, anime reviewers like me out there who, who have a, uh, if there are any anime reviewers out there who have um. Who 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 are who kind of suck like me at, at at making banners making banners for yourself? I I would I'd look this guy up and tr tr trust me he he's a really nice guy he'll he he will just look this guy up tr trust me he 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 seems to like doing this stuff but uh, yeah I'll I'll put his I'll put his I'll put his Facebook and his YouTube link in 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 the comments in in the description below and as well as of course check me out on Facebook Facebook. Twitter or Twitter or an or uh, or anime amino. I I have the same handle on there, but uh, yeah, guys, peace. <laughs>